things. I have something that I'm thankful for, and there's a bittersweet quality to it. It's a friendship that I developed with Pat Quinn, a tremendous Yankee fan who helped inspire the Ice Bucket Challenge. Pat found out he had ALS when he was 30 years old, and he made it his mission to spread awareness about ALS. He did not lament the fact that he got it, which was amazing to me, the courage that he showed, the bravery, and guys, how tough he was. He was a tough New Yorker who told ALS, I am going to fight you. I am going to live my life while I have this condition. Well, Pat passed away on Sunday. I am very thankful that I had this friendship with him. That last picture that you saw right there, we did a feature story on Pat. The Yes Network won an Emmy for it, but I always tell people we didn't win the Emmy. Pat Quinn won that Emmy, so we presented him with an Emmy at Yankee Stadium. The next day, he sent me a text, and he said, my man, thank you, thank you, <laughs> thank you. And I just want to say back to Pat, thank you, thank you, thank you, times a million. We will never forget you. Your legacy is everlasting. Well, Pat inspired so many, and in a statement put out on Monday morning, the Yankees said they were continually inspired by how Pat never allowed his warmth, humor, or spirit to be diminished, and that the Ice Bucket Challenge is a reminder of what can be accomplished in the face of unthinkable adversity. The way Pat courageously lived will forever be an inspiration to all of us, and the funding he helped raise dramatically accelerated the fight against ALS. We want to extend our deepest sympathies to the Quinn family and all of his supporters Pat, as Jack said, is never going to be forgotten.